Money Control presents Transforming a Billion Lives, presented by AWS Intel. This roundtable uh, on healthcare to the last mile, realizing digital in healthcare is uh, uh, a step in that direction. Joining me on the panel is Mr. Kostam Nair, co-founder and director of Periwinkle Technologies, and Ms. Veena Mukhtali, chief executive officer of Periwinkle Technologies. Thank you so much uh, for joining us. Kostam, from a technology provider perspective, how do you understand and evaluate the evolution of uh, digital healthcare in India? Digital healthcare has seen a significant uh, evolution in India in the recent years. Several factors have contributed to this growth, including uh, increased internet penetration, evolution of uh, AI ML technologies, the government's push towards digitization in healthcare, and the rising demand for affordable and accessible healthcare services. To evaluate this evolution, we'll have to consider various aspects, adoption of technologies, the impact on healthcare outcomes, and the challenges and opportunities presented by the market. The adoption of digital health technologies such as telemedicine, EHR, AI-enabled solutions such as SmartScope has been on the rise. This trend will continue as more people, including healthcare providers, become comfortable uh, uh, with using technology. We all know that COVID also helped in this. Digital healthcare has a huge potential to improve outcomes by increasing accessibility and scalability, thereby saving time and money. Digital healthcare in India presents several challenges, including the limited digital infrastructure in rural area, areas, the need for the government to make policy changes to adopt new technologies, etc. However, these challenges also present opportunities for the technology providers to develop innovative solutions that address this issue. Uh, Periwinkle has revolutionized cervical cancer screening. Uh, with a remote monitoring through your uh, smart scope solution. Take us through smart scope and how it's enabling efficient and uh, faster healthcare delivery, especially for women. Worldwide, around 3 lakh women die every year because their cervical cancer was not detected in time. Uh, in India itself, uh, every eight minutes, we uh, see a woman dying uh, because of this disease. So uh, when uh, the experts analyzed this situation, it was seen that uh, majorly the loss to follow up uh, by uh, you know, women was the major issue uh, uh, which was causing the mortality. So uh, with that in mind, we have developed the smart scope, which is a very nurse friendly uh, device, which does not require any infrastructure or any special setup so that it can be used uh, in any health and wellness center or any district hospital or any any uh, opd or camp for that matter uh, by uh, uh, healthcare personnel who are trained minimally so what that means is um, this test can be now available at any local opd for a woman uh, as a preventive checkup so uh, instead of waiting for the symptoms to show up, a woman can uh, you know, get herself tested regularly, even uh, during routine health examinations. Uh, uh, also, that means that the experts who are currently involved in uh, you know, extensive capacity building programs or in uh, uh, screening and triaging programs can also perform the same activities sitting at a higher center without having to travel uh, to each and every site. Um, that means more experts uh, time is available for uh, training uh, medical staff, more patients will be able to uh, take counseling from these experts. And that means we'll be able to uh, scale up the screening programs to a much greater extent than we are able to currently. With that, it's a wrap from all of us here. One of the key takeaways from this entire series of conversations is that healthcare and technology, integrating the two, will have to require a multi-stakeholder effort. It cannot be just driven by the private sector or by the government alone. What's heartening to hear and to learn is the number of startups that have emerged in this space and that have disrupted the healthcare space, making it only better for people like you and me. We'll be back with more. Thanks so much for watching.